Hey everyone, welcome to Land of the Dead, Road to Fiddler's Green. A uh, friend of mine, Darth Raven, put a couple videos of this up and I was like, you know what, I've been meaning to LP this game, but I was in the middle of Mass Effect 2 at the time. And I need a break from Mass Effect before I do 3. And I have to re-download 3 in the extended cut. So, I want to shoot something besides fucked up clicky faced aliens. So let's shoot some fucking zombies. Take a new game. Now, I'm going to be playing this on the normal difficulty. Namely because the only difference between normal and difficult is the number of bullets lying around. The zombies have the same health. So, you want to know how I got here? Sure, yeah, why I'll not? Tell you my story. It all started like this. I just finished feeding the hogs when the power went out. He's when fucking that happened, hogs. The time out here in the country. I yeah. tried calling the electric company, but the lines were dead. Yeah, well, damn. I didn't think too much of it at the time. Later that day, I noticed a stranger in my yard. Something wasn't right with him. The way he was just standing there. Get off my land! He wanted. You soon, bitch. <laughs> yeah. The only real difference between normal and difficult is pretty much the supply level. Uh, there are less bullets and less medical supplies lying around. The enemies pretty much do the same damage. They have the exact same health on difficult as they do on normal. Um, and I don't think you really want me to watch nothing but me go around hitting things with a melee weapon. In well, it's a solid, uh, it is a, the melee in this game works. What's wrong, boy? Son of a bitch! Get off my land! Get me my raffle! But yeah, the melee in this game de definitely works. It's functionable. Um, yeah. It's just... I don't think you want to watch me sit there and just melee zombies over and over and over and over again. So, I mean, there are guns in this game and stuff. Now, with the 22 rifle, with, I guess what you could call low impact weapons, low caliber, low power, however you want to say it. Uh, 22 rifle takes four shots to the body. Doesn't really matter where you hit them at. Ooh, pills. Um, oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta actually... Gotta actually use the bullets up on these things. Uh, the Glock 17 takes five shots. Doesn't matter where you hit them. And same for the, M, I think it's the M16, the assault rifle. Gotta get my gun out of the shit, holy shit! Oh, and he throws a haymaker! Alt fire on a lot of, uh... And a lot of the melee weapons will knock the enemy down. I think almost all of them, the alt fire. Punching zombies with your bare fist with the primary fire really doesn't do anything. I've never killed a zombie with my bare fists. Hammer, on the other hand. Got me a revolver, you sons of bitches! Bitch! Fucking claw hammer pip slap of the gods! Ooh. Problem is, the claw hammer does have rather short range. Ah! Fuck you, exhibit. Got him. 
A revolver is a heavier caliber, more power, and it can actually dismember zombies. God damn it, I blew her jaw off instead of a dome. Take that, old man Withers. Now, this is better. Shovel's better than a hammer. It's got range. Is there anything back here? Or I get my redneck ass stuck in the hay. Ooh, ranges. Seriously. Oh, you're Fatty McFatterson. Get off my land, you son of a bitch. Hammer. We don't want no damn diggity hammers. So, there we go. Let's see. Actually, I'm. Hmm. I don't really like that. I'm not. Since it takes four shots out of this bitch to level a zombie, I don't like having not a multiple of four with it. whenever you reload it. Hmm. I don't like having an off number of bullets with this either. But another funny thing you can do, you can shoot your fucking legs off. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, what the matter? Oh, I got one more thing I want to do. You can shoot one of your left arms off too, you son of a bitch. Oh, ain't he cute? He's flailing around. Ever hungry can learn to use weapons after a lot of trial and error. That makes them really gay. I killed the strangers. It was them or me. The poor devils looked like they fell in a septic tank and festered for a few days. I'd never killed no one before, so I sure was real spooked. I decided to head over to my neighbors across the cornfield. I just didn't feel safe hanging around here all by myself. I'm all alone now here ever since my cousin left me. I'm going to walk through a cornfield like a right stupid fuck. I mean, seriously, a cornfield dude. Alright, get some bullets up here so we can actually shoot some bitches. Now, there should be... a... crawler. Fuck you. Over here, Lantern. Oh, missed one of those shots. Uh, the alt, the alt fire on the shovel is you stab him and knock him down. Of course, that killed the bitch. Shovel is slower than the hammer, but it has a lot more range to it. Although, pimp slapping zombies with the claw hammers. Yeah. Pay that digger man all that money to plant your ass. Ew. Ah. What the hell? Hell, somebody fucking come all over your intestines? Aw, oh, dirty bitch. Right on her back and spreading her legs. Dirty zombie hooker. 
What's down here? Holy shit. That's the right way to go there. Oh, fuck my life. Shoot you right in your biscuits, bitch. Oh, shit. That makes that swing sound whenever you fucking take out the shovel. Like it's your fucking Excalibur. Swing! Take out about. I'd like to keep at least 20 rounds for the 22 on hand just in case they're, you know, sticky situations. Other than that, I can essentially take out three more zombie bags, and as long as I got four loaded and sixteen to spare. Hello. My neighbors were always known to keep freezers full of morphine pills lying around. Their boy had some bad habits, but I was thankful for that now. Hello? Children of the fucking corn, where art thou? Yeah, cornfield. Oh, I think I missed that. Yeah. Oh shit, here comes old man Withers. Ooh, shot to the dick makes him backflip. I can hear you out there. Don't eat me. I don't taste good. Oh, fuck my, fuck my life. The hit detection, uh, I don't know. It works, I guess. Yeah, that, that was exactly what I needed to do. Swing! I banish ye to the depths of the game world. May you forever fall into the infinite void. Okay, save the stamina. Well, yeah, around here somewhere. The problem is I just don't fucking know where. Found me a big ass rock. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Uh, I found my way back to where I started. I is one dumb, stupid redneck. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on just a tick. I think I know where I was going now. Here we go. Hang on, god damn it. Oh yeah, there's no toggle crouch. Never mind. Hey, over here. Oh, <laughs> 
Withers. Yeah, that's what difficult mode would be, is just beating things with a shovel. Another shovel over there, in case you didn't get one in the first. the bolt cutters are single. Look, I use the bolt cutters. Now, I don't have bolt cutters anymore. Me, I got me a revolver out. Max ammo for the revolver is 6 and, 30, uh, six and 36 to spare, so uh, I think I might want to pop some caps. Zombie gorilla and heat. little this is a real short stage and this stage let's see I don't think I can actually yeah trigger my neighbors were dead I didn't know what the heck was going on and I was scared to death reports of violence are coming in from neighboring states we're unsure at this moment what to make of the situation the governor is telling everyone to stay in their homes and has issued a uh, one moment folks Something has just come across my desk. I'm getting <laughs> Good old Xbox the, graphics. I'm having trouble reading this bulletin, but I've been told this has been confirmed by official sources. It appears that the dead are coming back to life and eating the flesh of the living. This is unbelievable news we're hearing. Uh, I, for one, am truly shocked. For those of you tuning in, this is not a joke. Something has gone horribly, horribly wrong. 
Bring it on, you undead fucks. Uh-oh. Eep. I said boom shakalaka. Now, on this level, this is the only place I've actually ever found this weapon. There's this book here. It says Kung Fu Zombie. It's not highlighted like any other normal item. I don't know how many there are in the game. I don't, this is the only one I know of. I know Kung Fu. You know Kung Fu? This is one of the most overpowered attacks in the game. If you hit a zombie with all five of the primary fire punches, they die. This just knocks them on their ass. Now, I will... I'm not going to keep this whole game because it, it is cheap as fuck. Besides, I'd rather use something else like, oh, I don't know, a fire axe. But just to demonstrate... You just bowl over and just knock him over with the secondary fire, and yeah. That's the reason I blew old man Withers' leg off upstairs so I can come down here, because, yep, there's a radio. Except for the fact that they can rip your doors down. So that really doesn't help there, Jones. Hey, old man Withers. That's why I shot his leg off, just so you know. He wouldn't bother us. There we go. Because when you kill the last zombie, the mission ends. Now I will grab, a, I will grab another, a different melee weapon. I did what the man on the TV Eventually. said and stayed on the farm as long as I could. Make me I got by well, okay, fart me up a shitstorm. Hooey! The shortwave radio said that the military had some safe houses set up in the city. I was running low on supplies and starting to go crazy all by myself. I had nothing to lose. I was gonna go see my sister. The city looked like a war zone. Roads everywhere were blocked. I didn't know where to go until I noticed a flicking light in the hospital up ahead. Someone was signaling SOS. I wasn't gonna let a few block roads stop me from getting to another living person. I'd go on foot. And by foot, I mean instead of walking directly at the fucking hospital up over yonder, I'm gonna take me crazy ass to the fucking sewer. <laughs> Full ammo for this son of a bitch. Might want to pop me some zombie bags. <laughs> ah! The homeless!
Okay, I killed everybody that I probably should have shot. Alright, let's just grab... Oh! Well, that works. There's only one stash of 22 rounds over there. doesn't have shits going to go down written all over it. Take that, Granny. Really, is that you? Ah, fuck. Gay Mohawk. Change. Fucking panhandlers. Oh, I don't have anywhere to live. Bullshit. You didn't have anywhere to live, aren't you out here begging for money when it's cold out? Oh no, you only come come out when the weather's nice. There's actually some career panhandlers uh, near this one shopping center. <laughs> near where the uh, closest GameStop that I go to is. They're always there, only in the summer. It's the same people. And uh, the funny thing is, uh, people found out that they're actually just regular fucking people. They're not actually homeless. They're just la you know, lazy fuckers. They're like, I don't have a job or anything. Bullshit. You, you do in the winter, don't you? Ah, Skeletor. God damn it, it took his jaw off. He's good to the homeless. Wait, did I grab the... Was it bullets or medical supplies back here? I forgot. Drugs. Pills over here! Shut up, Lewis. Ah, here we go. Nom nom. your can around here, boy. 
Oh, shit. Water wench. As long as I don't get attacked by bats or giant toads. Bats! No, He-Man! Banish ye to the depths of the realm. Resident Evil 1 zombies with the invincibility when they're getting up. Now, when you pick up a new melee weapon from the zombie kung fu book, you don't drop the book, so you can't get it back. So, we now have Louisville Slug and Whack-a-Mac. Whack You know, I don't think it's a fact that they can smell living flesh up to a mile away. 
I think it's they can smell somebody shit their pants from up to a mile away. Anyway, I'm going to cut this clip off real quick and start a new one for integrity's sake. File integrity. Uh, so I'll catch you for the next one. Later.